Hello, everybody. My name is Jacob, aka Jacoby04. Um, I have nothing else clever to say. And I am here with my good friend Beth, who you cannot see her now because she's over there. And she's getting herself some tea ready because she needs all the comfort she can get. I need the same because we are lost in the woods. So, yeah, we're picking up right where we left off last time. Um, we didn't even take any more time to really think about it, so we're just gonna go with it. What if it's where the faces are facing? Ooh. Let's try this direction. So this one faced this tree. Okay. Now where's this tree facing? Find its mouth. Go from that point. It's facing this tree. Yeah. This tree is facing this tree. That tree is facing back. Nope! Yeah. Ah, dip, dip. <laughs> Seemed like it was going Maybe well. Maybe it's only open face trees? <laughs> That's racist. Oh my god, no! I walked so far back, I'm back at the beginning. Well, at least we know which way to go now. Speed run. Speed run. Okay, I could use some stamina right now. That is what I said I'm up big next time, because I wanted to reach seven hearts before I up, it, up my stamina a second time. That's a good goal. And they were that way? Then it was straight back that way. I want to make sure I'm on the right path, though, to it, you know, because if I go too off the edges. Yeah. Oh, it was. It was this way, right? I don't, don't remember. I thought it, I thought I saw a light the other way, but I couldn't bend the sparks. Like see there. I don't see anything that way. I thought it was like the exact opposite of that way. Ah, oh, there it there, is. There, they hide those pretty well. Yeah. Okay, so let's not go backwards again and mess that up. Um, I say go that way. Just go this way? Yeah. There's got to be something to it. Like, clearly they're not just hoping for me to aimlessly wander. And then did we go that way again? I don't know which way to go from here. There. That, that way? Direction, yep. Towards the like, gap or the tree? The tree. I feel like I've done this way before. But maybe not. Oh! Okay, that's... No! Uh, no! Stop! 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 Ah! What? There are two trees. There's gotta be a pattern. That way seems safe-ish. I'm convinced. I've been all the way out to this tree, even. There's a lot of ways it seems like it's letting me go at first. It's a maze. It's amazing. It's amazing. That seems like death. Mm -hmm. Anytime I get near these trees, this game's like, no fuck you. Want me to go in your mouth, little buddy? Yeah, he does. I don't want to put out my torch. Nope, nope. Uh, the music is just amazing. Where? Du -du 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 Don't set yourself on fire. And where are we going? That helped not at all. Now I don't have a torch. We're just going to have to start by process of elimination and hope that I see something on the way eventually, right? So we're going to go straight out until I get smarter and figure out what this pattern is that I'm missing. I'm glad that I have a second set of brains for uh, this particular episode. Have a brain? See, there are two of these guys here. Nope. Uh, yeah. Fuck you, game! Maybe it's in the beginning. That would tell us how to do it. Like, we have to follow the same steps that we followed to get here. I'm like, just I gotta up take a right. Stuff. You gotta take a hard right, you're saying? Yep, go that way. For how many torches? We have like three? No. Maybe it's the opposite. <laughs> I don't Am I getting know. sent back to the way beginning again from that laugh? Hopefully. 
What's laughing at me? Who's the jerk? Okay, well, I'm going out at a diagonal this time, then. I went far right. I went back straight. Wait, wait. Go back around the street. Left side. Go left. Face that. Oop. Whatever. I don't need that anyway. Face what? That tree. Go to that tree. There is a lot of open mouth trees over here. No, 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 no. no. I feel like I'm going to kill whoever this is when I find them. Um, who's the one that rode the wolf in the... Midna? Yeah. Sounds like her laugh a little bit. A little. Not quite. It sounds more like one of the witch's laughs from Ocarina of Time. Ooh. Or Majora's Mask. I haven't played either of those. But I've seen you play. Majora's Mask. Majora's Mank. Well, I wonder if I can just go really slowly like that and eventually have it tell me. And stop. That's good. <laughs> maybe. Maybe maybe that's my maybe that's my way, right? And stop. Seems safe. Nope, nope. I'm gonna nope the fuck out of here. Do you hear that? What is that? That was terrifying. It sounded big and scary. No, because we went that way and it was saying no. But now it's saying yes? Wait, it was over there. See? What? I'm terrified. I'm excited. That tree has no face. I know, we're getting to trees without faces now. Which is, I think, good. It means we got we got somewhere far. I don't know where, but we got somewhere. Oh. I just gotta go slow in case it's about to kill me again. Nope. I'm I'm so lost. I have never been so lost in a video game before. Success, Nintendo. I'm just petrified to move because I feel like I've made it somewhere and I don't want to lose my progress. Well, open up your map. So we can tell roughly where we're getting to. So we went somewhere to the left. If we could get to the middle open area, I feel like we would be safe. I'm putting a stamp on where I'm at. That way I know the direction that I had to start going in. That's what's been scaring the shit out of me. Ooh, it's a deer. Except I don't know. Okay, let me face... So this is where I came from, somewhere in here. Yeah. So I'm still facing out, so that's... Good, maybe. I feel like going too far to the left is bad. This seems like wrong. I feel like if you get to the edge, maybe it'd be fine. That seems like a nope to me. It's too open. That seems too open as well. Yeah, it's catching up to me. That seems like a wall of no. What's that tree? It's little. I wonder if they're trying to lead me into those deer. See, now we're getting into thinner trees too. Those birds are just... Do I climb this? <laughs> No! Ah! The frustration is real. It's kind of funny. For me. Your um, face is kind of funny. Um, <laughs> oh, those jerks! They took your pin off? Yes! It probably resets the world like to when you went there last. So I went out a little ways, and then I kind of just kept checking the border. It was basically what I was doing, right? Until I kind of walked through here. Take a break. Yeah, I remember this mouth. And I was like, hey, there's that mouth. And I was like, hey, I'm going to keep walking this way. And now you're closer to the border than you were before. Nope, nope. Too close. Okay. So left. 
somehow. Left and right. Oh, see, now there's faceless trees. I didn't notice those before. So that one's faceless. This one. This is where I was at. Wait. That was awesome. Should I go back to my slow approach, I guess? Uh, this is that big open area where I started hearing deer, and then I ran this way. And then I cross this open field. If you're lucky I don't want to put out my torch right now, deer. I would be murdering your face and eating your prime meat. So don't climb that rock, because that rock's a dick. No! Nope. <laughs> We're gonna do this. Yeah, we are. Okay, we got it. Hey, pull that tree. Take a left. Take a left. Go around these guys. This dead tree. Will be a tree with an open mouth somewhere, right someplace. Uh, this dude. We want to go past him. Go ahead. We want to go pretty much straight. Um, then we're gonna get to a kind of an open area tree. right here, and then we go to the right. And then we're, yep. Go to the left now. No, because no, that's went, the edge of the boundary. We went straight before. No, it's not the edge. It's the middle where the little open area. Opens. No, because this leads to the rock. See, I'm at the rock again. Yeah. So you think I should go left up the rock? Yeah, I think you should go down that way. It does lead to opening in there. I'll go with it. That sounds right. I'll. Aha! A passage. A gap. Yep. Use right. Use ain't wrong. At a girl. Don't climb the rock. Don't go to the right of the rock. Go to the passage. To the left of the rock, folks. You saw it here first. I'm the very first person <laughs> on Zelda Breath of the Wild to ever get through the Lost Woods. No YouTuber has ever done this before. Subscribe for more. JK. This would be a bigger JK. They, they don't need to know. I'm kidding. Woo! Whoa. That is so cool. I don't think I need this anymore. I need a big sword you to cut to, down these fucking trees. You need to save. Use ain't wrong again. See, this is why I always need someone <laughs> watching me play live and in person. Well, I wish someone was with me when I was playing Skyrim and oh, Fallout. Man. Just like, oh gosh. There they are, the Koroks! We made it! After many, many episodes, folks. The Korok forest is upon us. Ah! It's, it's right there. Can you fast travel to it? There better be a temp shrine here for me to fast travel to. That would be very upsetting if there wasn't. I'll listen to this music again. <gasps> a sword? Not a sword. A sword? The sword. I'm gonna save in case something goes wrong. I think you have to be like stronger to pick up the sword. But you've been working. I I don't I don't trust myself. Should I go for it? What do you think? Yes or no? Should I just I try? I think it? since you saved, you should try. Expecting to find the master sword here. It's oh, the great Deku tree. Did I do off again? After 100 years, I've nearly given up hope on seeing you again. Even my patience has limits, you know. That look on your face tells me that you have no recollection of me, however. I have watched. 
That is the weapon created by the ancient goddess. The sword that seals the darkness that only the chosen might can wield against the calamity cannon. Believe it or not, it was actually you who wielded that sword 100 years ago. But I must warn you to take extreme caution. The sword stands as a test to anyone who would dare attempt to possess it. As you are now, I cannot say whether you are worthy or not. If you sought to free the sword in any sort of wicked state, you would surely lose your life where you stand. <laughs> Yeah, I I don't think I'm ready. Maybe in like another 40 episodes, I'll be there. Not now. Hey, a new main quest. Well, we're gonna get stamina and strength. The hero sword. It says, can you claim it in your current state? I don't know, man. I'll save it again. I'll save it again, and I'll just, I'll just give that sword a little tug. Just give it a little yank. You know? A little, little yank. I don't know. That's what, that's all I'm saying. <laughs> now I see where this is going. <laughs> So you have to have a certain number of hearts to get the Master Sword. Okay. You need, like, seven more. Because you only, like, pulled it up one notch when... I, I guess you could say I'm having troubles getting it up. <laughs> it happens to everybody, Blink. Don't worry about it. You're pretty. That's kind of a weird-looking one. I don't get it. I don't get what its face is, yeah. I think the mouth is where the line is. Sure, test my metal. Oh, there's a bunch of shrines in the Korok Forest. This is good to know. That's awesome, because I can get hearts and or stamina up. I mean, now I'm inclined to just keep going for hearts so that I can get the Master Sword. What's up here? Whoa. This place is sweet. Hey, little buddy. Look at this. Oh, this is cool. This place you is... Hear that hey, there's one shrine right there. Should I go for it right away? Yeah, let's do it. This yeah. is going to be an action-packed episode. Is, let me... I want to... Start up that quest that they told me to do. Side quest card trials. Set destination for that one. The test of wood. <laughs> My wood's ready to be. There's so many innuendos in this episode. It's too easy. This is like Digimon. We don't do no filler. No fillers. No fillers. Other than the one episode that I literally titled about. Or no, I, I claimed the entire episode that it was a filler episode. I was, I was testing my mic. Give me, sue me. Was it sue a filler? I, it pretty much was. I'll I wouldn't. It. Not that I don't. It's, want it to was. <laughs> cool things happen during it. Yeah. Is this the shrine that he wanted me to go to? Faithful stars. I know. I keep opening this, 
but I'm just trying to get my bearings. Oh, wow, this is another shrine on top of these other shrines. So whatever I do, I just don't want to go back to these lost woods. I would like to go check out Lake Sarai while I'm here, as well as Makar Island. There's a lot of cool stuff in this and forest. And the swamp. Yeah, the swamp. But if there are four shrines here, that's a full heart or stamina. Okay, fine. A stamina. What does this one get? Look for the star. Look to the stars for guidance. The constellations are the key. Oh. Wait, do I? Oh, oh. What? Hold up. Okay. Well, I got a couple of balls. I don't have very many of them. I think you have to roll them through. I mean, I pick them up and put them in places and it activates them. I've seen this in different trials. But the question is where, based on one, two, three, four, five. There's clearly numbers going on here. Right? I don't know. You're walking too fast. Can't think. Hmm. Oh, wait, go up. Up where? Up at the main map. Right there. Oh. Don't, okay. don't submit. Okay, perfect. Okay. This isn't the, the one in the bottom that left matches to the one to the far right. You see that? They match ones that are up there. Yeah. So one ball goes into the second one up because there's like one row and then there's another row. I'm just going to base it off of. So can you reset the thing? Look to the stars. Okay. okay. So I got an idea. Okay. Okay. So that one on the left, right over there, on the no, on the constellation. There's a certain number of them. Um, there's four. There's five of the little ones. You got to count up the number of ones that there are. I don't think so. Yep. And if I'm wrong, we'll try your idea. Okay. So this is the two-armed one. There is... One... Two. Three. 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 This has to be it. Okay, fine. Maybe yours is... I was basing it off a of position. One only? Of the complicated guy? Yeah. And then the long one. There should be two. Two, that looks about right. If we add them all up, we'll see if we're off at all after this. I don't think you're <laughs> off. Yeah. Too big for there to be nothing going on, uh huh? There's more. There's another gate over there. You see that? Yeah, the constellation. I bet if I move the balls around again to whatever this is showing, this will open up. Okay. So that's what we want to do. Hold well, on, look at so it. So I'll, I'll count up the small ones. You count up the big, complicated one. Okay. So there's wait. So there's one skinny. There's two branches. There's two double arms, and there's four, so skinny, two okay. double arms. Two complicated and four little ones. Yep. I think we can remember that. One, two, two, four. Skinny had one. Still there. No, you gotta move. Oh. That one had two. One. Two. Two on this one. Yep, and then four on the other one. Yeah, you need that stamina. Nice. Cool. What do we get for our for our extra efforts? Wow. 
looks like fun. I've used this spear a lot. It's probably... Oh, that spear is already gone. What do I want to get rid of? What's that? I feel like that Korok spear is the best thing to get rid of. I just want to drop it, though, so that I can take a picture of it. That way, if I ever want it again, I can get it back. Okay. I didn't even get to use the thing. Actually, I can take a picture like this, go to selfie mode. There we go. That way, if I want to use it, I don't have to worry about it. <laughs> yeah, you can make him pose, too. He makes some derpy looking faces. What about the other side of the room? Nothing. They usually only have one extra chest in them. Alright, there's one trying. One more, and then I can get my stamina up. Then after that, I'm going right back to hearts until I'm at probably ten. Ten sounds good. I'll do like one stamina for every three extra hearts from now. Because this is a heavier, these have been heavier running episodes than usual. Usually I'm not sprinting around this much. So if every one of those Korok things that they showed is a shrine, we're going to have lots of shrines coming up here in the next couple episodes. I would like to see if the big... With the last few minutes we got left in this episode, I want to see if my big Korok friend that can exchange seeds for items is right there! Wow, well, that was that was like on demand. That was that was really that was really easy. That's so cool That's looking. That's cute. Heard this you. is the guy that has been leading here. I must do you found me! Um, weapon stash again right away? How many do I need? Eight? Sure, why not? One more. He came. He was really excited. Da, na, 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 na. There we go. Now I can go get my spear again. <laughs> I don't have enough. I, I'll, I'll explore. I'll let this one run a few minutes over because I want to do a little bit of exploring of this Korok forest while I'm here. So now that I have a shrine, I can fast travel back here if I need to, which is good. Um, There's probably more shrines in the whole forest, besides the floor. I don't know. This is a pretty clustered area to have that many shrines, because if you look at the whole overworld, like, that's four in this little space, but yet you look at it like this, this is four in this big space. Yeah, but then you look down at the more... Yeah, but area. this was just because it was the plateau at the start of the game. Oh, uh, okay. There so. haven't been shrines that clustered anywhere, which isn't to say that, like, I wouldn't... Four is already a lot. You have a lot of stamps. I play stamps. Stars typically mean like points of interest, like Koroks, I think I missed, or things like that. This means good supplies or food of some sort. Um, this means some sort of thing to kill. Um, I put these stamps down wherever I see a shrine, but don't feel like dealing with that at the time, or like see them far away. Oh, okay. This is where I think weapons are, or things to battle are, I can't remember. Um, this is a cool nature thing that I want to explore. So that's typically what they mean. Okay. All right, clearly I'm ready now after that one trying. Um, so I talked to that dude. It's a little hard to see in here still. Can, can I climb your face? Can I climb the Deku tree's face? They're gonna get mad at me for disrespecting him. Give me a kiss. Give me a kiss. Your mustache needs to be trimmed. Whoa, uh, thank you, Tree. I don't think you should be putting your mouth there. I don't know if we know each other well enough yet. Jacob.
I'm loving the music here. It's so light. I just want to climb the Deku tree. There's got to be something on top of him, right? It just seems like a place they would throw something. That's what she said. On top of the Deku tree? Or there has to be something up there? He said you... there has to be something on top of him. <laughs> okay, there you go. I said a lot of things in that period of time. There's his eyes, I think. Right? Yeah. Uh, or is this oh, still his mustache? A, it looks like his eyebrow, I think. Oh, no! Yeah, stupid son of a biscuit, Link. You want to get some of the other I should be able to make it. Oh, yeah, Oh, I see crap. It. Is it that time of the night already? What time of the night? He'll see. Do you transform? Transform into a boner fart. <laughs> Music is so unnerving. What's gonna happen? Oh. Blood moon Blood rises. Moon rises once again. This brings all the monsters back to the overworld. So all the ones that you kill come back. Darn. It's so light here. Do you see my feet? Like <laughs> you're dancing. Well, that was some. This is some funny. There we go. That's back to normal a little bit. What? The climb animation there. Uh, I'm gonna get in your brain. Whoa! <gasps> a great fairy fountain. The second one I've found. Oh, huh? crouch, okay. I gotta grab these fairies. Those fairies are super important. Okay. Because so, when I die, they bring me back to life. They're basically like extra lives. God. Is there only that many? What are you doing? Sound good. I'll tell you a riddle about an object. Your job is to solve the riddle and bring me the correct object. Small, red, round, and sweet. An apple. I like I like riddles. Oh, it's a side quest. Okay. I was I thought this was gonna be a great fairy fountain, but nope. There's just a couple fairies. Uh, materials. Good thing I have a couple of these in, on hand. Do I talk to you? No, you have to place it on the leaf. On the leaf? What if I'm just feeding this fucker? <coughs> Kakariko specialty fruit, rock hard flesh is quite resolute. Pumpkin. I don't know if I have any of them right now. Fudge. Fudge sickles. Yeah, I don't have any of them right now. Oh well, we'll come back to it later. Yeah, I don't care enough to go chasing down a random pumpkin for a side quest. Yeah. Oh good, they they leave the riddle in my quest log so I can remember to grab it without having to like come back here just ask. I can break those things. Okay, well, I climbed the Deku tree's head. I think that's a good place to end it. <gasps> pretty cool. Thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed this episode as much as I did. It was pretty freaking epic. A lot happened here. Um uh, We'll catch y'all next time. Thanks, Beth, for joining me, and have a good one.